your time who knows we got lights and laws and mirrors too and this texan god is gonna lecture you bill howdy folks it's me your friendly neighborhood texan by god just waking up from a little celestial nap right now and wanted to tell you that today we're diving into the wild and wacky world of the inverse square law sounds fancy huh but really it's just about how lights like to fade away like me after a spicy plate of chili. We're gonna show you how to use it so your actors can run around like headless chickens and still look great. So buckle up, folks, and let's get to it. Well, hey now, I recognize these two scoundrels anywhere. That there is Matt Bendo, camera slinger, light wrangler, and certified image helping. And that, well, that's the gold bastard not made of gold, he's just real damn committed to the bit. Alright folks, now that we're done with the introductions, let's add a little bit of sunshine to the mix and light up our two friends real nice and bright. Don't they just look perfect when they're so close together? But now, well, what if we move them a little bit apart? Looks like that light's got a mind of its own when it's this close. See how it just falls off real quick? Well, we've got a bit of a challenge on our hands now, don't we folks? Well, let me just introduce a special little buddy of mine. Hey, folks, it's me, Photon Phil. Shining bright and ready to light up the world. Just look at me go, nothing can stop me. That's the spirit, Phil. Keep on shining, buddy. Oh, yeah, but wait. As I keep going, it feels like I'm fading, losing 75% of my intensity every time I double my distance. What's happening to me? Maybe it's all just a never-ending darkness out there. Maybe there is no God. I don't know what we're going to do if you can't light the way. I don't want to die. Easy now, little buddy. We'll get you back home to Mama. And don't fret. We'll light up both these fools evenly. I got just the guy to help us out. My name's Longhouse Sam, and I deep fry beverages. Not because it's easy, not because it's right, but because it's the only way I know how to love. You don't win hearts with hydration. You win them with grease. I have three heart attacks every hour. So when I'm gone, my son will carry the torch. I personally drink two out of every three batches of Longhouse Sam's bacon lard bourbon. So the brain damage my products have caused me came with one particular side effect. An uncontrollable obsession with blowing smoke over miniature sets to make light beams visible. That sweet spot where the fall-off's gradual? Well, that's what we're after, folks. And that mirror, it just helps us get creative with the way that we extend that path. And that beam behaves like the light's coming from way the hell over there. Just remember, folks, the farther you extend that path, the more gradual the fall off gets. <laughs> Here I go again, still losing 75% of my power every time I double my distance. But I've gone so far that the fall off's real gradual now, so who the hell cares? <laughs> and that's how you light both them boys, nice and even, without frying one and forgetting the other. Well, now look at that. With that slow, gentle fall off stretching across the stage, our boys are free to run wild and wander all over this here playground. Hey, boys, no roughhousing now. And those guys are weird as hell. <laughs> all right, partner, what do you say we take a look at these mirrors here? It's clean, precise, sharp as a new pair of spurs. Kind of like a saddle that's seen a few rodeos. Soft as morning fog rolling across those dusty plains. Casting a dramatic slash of light, kind of like a cowboy's shadow at sunset. But it's got me thinking, folks. What if we took one of each of these bad boys and put them all together? I bet we'd be scattering photons all over the place. Kind of like gold bastards scattering them pool balls everywhere but the pockets. Difference is, folks, we ain't knocking around them photons with just one pool cue. No, sir. We're using four different strengths of mirrors in one rig. Bouncing the same source off each one just a little differently. Gives us a textured look. Not uniform, it's got some edge, some shape. Kind of like old gold bastard himself. Rough around the edges, but mighty fine to look at. 
Let's show these folks what you can really do. Ha, this man plays mighty fine under pressure. The old one, two, three. Classic. This man's one slack-jawed yokel. Yahoo, be careful now. Oh, we called that one two in the left pocket. Watch out, hog cowboy. Oh, he's the old grip jaw. Hee haw. Haven't seen that one since that thing I can't talk about. <laughs> All right, y'all. Those little mirrors do the job like a single drop of hot sauce. Fine if you're cooking up for a mouse. But a big old mirror? That's pouring the whole bottle on a brisket. And I reckon Photon Phil's got something to say about this one, too. Hello, Photon Phil here, folks. Looks like I blew the whole budget on my first fancy animation. So now I'm just calling in this time. I'd be shooting out of that lot and bouncing off that big old mirror. By the time I get there, the fall off's so gradual that everything just looks beautiful. Oh, folks, we just lost connection with Photon Phil, so uh, we're going to cut to commercial break. Goldbusters, greedy gold bickle bananas. They borrow gold and stolen bathtub. They throw in banana. It cry. Maybe you get sick, maybe you get rich. Who cares? Eat fast. Police come. The government found the stash, so now it's gotta go. You want a placebo? You got it. Flowers for your future funeral. Tony strength giggle juice. Non-functional functionality formula. It doesn't work. Quasimodium, it'll turn you into a hunchback. All five of the price, so who cares? Take them now. No receipt. No eye contact. Thank you for sitting through my bullshit. We started with a mighty fine light, but now... We've got one twice as bright with a beam five times as narrow. It's packing a whole heap of power. Might as well just upgrade these two fellas as well. Best be putting on your goggles for this one, boys. The 2400 watt light and a parallel beam like this? Hell, this boy right here, he's gonna light things up brighter than a supernova riding a lightning bolt. Attention citizens, modern technology. Remember when we had those miniatures roaming all over the stage earlier? Well, look at us now. Just had to scale things up. We can do the same thing with the real folks right here. With this big old light and those giant mirrors, we're turning that playground into a full-scale wonderland. So go ahead and have some fun, boys. Just no roughhouse. Oh, the up, down, all around. He just three stooged him. Classic slapstick. He burned it to go master. Oh, placebo tonic right on top of that stupid haircut of his. He is an ugly, ugly man. He's got the giggle juice. That's felony strength, damn it. Old bastard's just standing there like some sort of stupid idiot. He won't be giggling. Not after that. You better believe that it. That tower's gonna go for a damn two shot. Old bastard just grabbed a bottle of Longhouse Sam's big and large bourbon. That bottle oh, was a limited edition. He's spinning like a poorly loaded washing machine. He learned that move from the great Photon Phil. May he rest in peace. He was the light of my life. Sadly, he passed away during a high-speed police chase on his way to San. Funeral-ready oh, flowers. Those were meant him. for Photon oh, Phil. Oh, He's about to make his own What's that on the eulogy. table? A full tank of Quasimodium. Quasimodium? That's biological warfare. Bye. Gold Faster just hit him with a full tank of Quasimodium. The papers are everywhere. By God, he's folding like an accordion, folks. He is turning, I repeat, he is turning into a hunchback. Who authorized that tank of Quasimodium? Never have I witnessed Who? the transformation of this magnitude. Not since the legendary Quasimodo Ali. When he went 12 rounds with wackadoo foreman high on mushrooms in that unforgettable bout, the rumble and the fungal. It was a hell of a match. I still get flashbacks when I smell portobello. Look at the unorthodox footwork of Hunchback Man. Fancy footwork don't mean nothing when you bring a friend to help you fight dirty. Oh, no. The mini gold bastard is attacking God, no. that Hunchback He's freak. grabbing the only bottle of wackadoo magoo's oh, non-functioning functionality well, formula. It's a In the knockout. name of human. That's the only solution that wouldn't work May anyway. Wackadoo Magoo rot in hell for what he did here today. 